Good afternoon, folks. This is Captain Hitting Art in the flight deck, joined by First Officer Newton. Howdy, folks. We've reached our cruising altitude, so we're going to go ahead and turn off the fastened seatbelt sign. Computer saying we'll have you in San Francisco just a hair past three. For now, sit back, relax, and enjoy the flying. Thanks for flying, JetBlue. Woo! So, as I was saying, I need to get a laid. <laughs> I'm very backed up. <laughs> Me too. These pipes be clogged, sir. Yeah. Saw an old Scooby-Doo episode on the airport TV, and Daphne was getting me hot. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. You know what? I bet Velma had a tight little body under that big sweater, right? Ooh. <laughs> that she does. <laughs> you know Velma and Shaggy were banging. Ooh. Imagine Scooby just sat at the foot of the bed watching. Racky, around you, rolling. Oh, oh like, like nothing, Scoob. Me and Velma are like wrestling. God, I need to get laid. What the hell are they talking about? Hi, please stop talking. Your intercom button's still on. The passengers oh. heard all of that. Oh, thank you. Uh, hi, folks. <laughs> on behalf of JetBlue, I'd like to apologize for that adult chat you just heard. Uh, Button on the intercom broke. Uh, just one of the many small electronic problems you run into on a very old plane like this. Very old plane? <clears throat> yeah, um, calling the plane old didn't go over well with the passengers. You might want to settle their nerves. Okay, yeah. Uh, thanks. You're an A-plus flight attendant. Okay, I'm not a flight attendant. I am a sky liaison. Okay, okay yes, sir. Here, I'll take this one. Okay. Howdy, gang. First Officer Noonan here. This plane is just fine. We spoke with an engineer at the Applebee's bar right before the flight, and he said this plane is good for a few more trips. They were at the bar. Those perverts were drinking. Man, not as much as me. <laughs> yeah, howdy, folks. Just realized that bar comment might have made you think we were drinking before the flight. Uh, no siree. I do not drink messes with all the medications I'm on. Oh my god, we're gonna die. And you, you are doing jackass to make me feel better. Hey, lady, you're freaking screaming. How are you not freaking out right now? Because I took a Xanax, baby. I'm Hakuna Matata. Anyway, we want to tell you about JetBlue's featured in-flight movie. Why do they keep saying JetBlue? It's not a JetBlue flight. This month's featured movie is teen comedy Booksmart. Fun for the whole family. Maybe not the whole family. There's some lesbian stuff in there. But I don't think you see them going down on each other or anything. Ooh. Whoa, whoa, shouldn't have said going down, because it might make you think of the plane going down, which, which it won't until we land safely in San Diego. Oh, but, but this flight is supposed to go to San Francisco. Uh, baby, give me a Xanax. I, I wish I could, but no. Nah. <laughs> All right, folks, that's it from the flight deck. So sit black, relax. <laughs> I say sit black. Uh, what does that mean? <laughs> yeah, sit black, I guess. Sit there and uh, start rapping in your seats or something. Like, uh, yeah. Sorry if that was racially insensitive. I did not mean it that way. Yeah. You know what? Uh, from now until Christmas, non-whites fly free on JetBlue. That's not real. I just made that up. So sit black. Whoop. Said it again. Book smart. Enjoy the flight. <clears throat> oh, looks like we got some choppy air. Go ahead and uh, turn off that fastened seatbelt sign. <clears throat> yep, there you go. Oh my god, Douglas, Douglas, the mask! Hakuna Matati, baby. 